How's it going guys? Do a face here. Welcome back to another shorter sort of video. Today we're going to be showing off the new Ninji speedrun because I thought I should upload something, but also not just upload another J7 video, so I thought, hey, I'm gonna cover the speedrun before we run out of time to finish it, so I'm gonna do a run through with commentary and then I'm gonna try to do a good run at the end, though if I can't, then hopefully that should be fine. And be sure to check it out quickly if you haven't because there's 16 hours left, so let's get right into it. So this level starts off with a P balloon and a time thing. As you can see, I could have timed that much better. And it is very Mario Karty. And yeah, you just kind of like shoot around trying to find the best way to speedrun with this frickin' power up. Of course, it's very hard to actually do any effective speedrunning with this power up because, like, who uses this? <laughs> like, who, um, yeah. And then at the very end of the level, you gotta do a bit of a circle around to gather a bunch of coins. Is that a new record for me? It might be a new record for me. So now I'm gonna look up a good route to speedrunning this, and I'm gonna try and replicate it on video, so... Let's see what I can do. And... Yep, that's a way better record, what the heck? Alright, I'll try to do a better record now. Alright, so it seems that the primary strat is to grab the balloon, and get a good head start like that, and then from there, you just make a bunch of very small turns to help get yourself a little bit more speed. At this point, you're meant to stop around there and then do a sort of angle like that. So far, I'm going pretty well, because none of the ninjas are actually in front of me. Though, of course, this is far from the best. In fact, I just watched the best. The, the best was extremely impressive, and I have no idea how they did it. Oh, and also, they did a different coin path, too. They went around like this, to minimize distance. Wow, yeah, that's a lot faster. I might keep going at that, but... That looks like it's a pretty good time. It's better than before, anyway. Because this seems really hard to speedrun, because, you know, it's the... Pea Balloon. Who uses this to speedrun, after all? And... This is a much better improvement? Yeah, wow. This is a very hard record to beat. The... Just... The fact that people... It only took people a week to find just how to use this P-Balloon for speedrunning, and that's crazy to me. Alright, I'm gonna try for another attempt, but if not, then, like, this will be the best attempt of the video. Alright, good start. Alright, this is actually really good. Yo, these ninjas just got clapped, yo! Oh man, I just beat my record by like three seconds. Okay, okay, that's where I'm gonna end the video for now. I might upload a sequel if I get an even faster time tomorrow, but I don't even know if there'll be enough time to keep doing it tomorrow. Alright, wow, I'm actually really happy with that. Let's see how much I improved. Alright, that's so satisfying. I'm in one of the bottom rungs. Like, the, t the top rungs. That's awesome. Um, of course, I'm still, like, behind 6,600 people, but I've only started properly speedrunning this today, so I'm pretty glad. So anyways, I hope you all enjoyed this short little video from me. There'll be a JSEM video soon, and after that we'll return to your regularly scheduled programming of Super Mario Maker Trolls and Uno Mass levels and all sorts, alongside Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, and I'll upload when I can. I can't promise I'll maintain daily uploads, but I hope you'll enjoy nonetheless. And I hope you enjoyed this short little video too. If you want to see more videos where I play hard levels like this, or like, levels to speedrun like this, please leave a like and subscribe, and for now, I will see you all in the next one.
You can leave now.